Hey! Congratulations, sir. And you guys won a million dollars. All right, everybody, welcome back to the greatest sales force on planet Earth. We're here with the Ninos, with the Nevo team out here in Texas. And guys, we are so excited. Today, we're gonna learn exactly how to have your energy at an all-time high while you're out in the doors, because we all know that sales is a transfer of energy. So we wanna inject and affect the homeowner with our enthusiasm so they don't eject and reject us. But guys, we're so excited to compete out here, be a part of the greatest transfer of wealth of our entire generation. And if you guys do wanna be a part of our team, click the link in the bio, and let's get into the morning meeting. What would it look like if everything in your life like went perfect? right? Like really think about that, right? Because we got to be what we call like co-creators of our future. So this is something that really hypes me up, like really hypes me up because it's like you can literally change your life, like Skylar was saying, in just one day. One deal pays the bills for the months. Two deals, you can buy yourself, you know, a new, a new car, right? Three, four, five deals, you can get into a new zip code, right? But I really want you guys to think about that for a second. Like what would it look like if everything went right for you with just your physical health? right? Like who in here feels like you can get 1% better with your physical health, right? All of us. Who, who feels like they can do a little bit better with like mental health, right? One thing I talk about with Battle of the Gains, like dude, mental health is a real thing, right? And there's a stigma and people don't want to talk about it. But the biggest thing is like so many times we're complaining, right? And complaining is literally like the lowest form of communication because we're just complaining, right? But it's like, it's a real thing. And so to be able to be vulnerable with people and be like, dude, I've struggled. I've thought about throwing in the towel. I've, you know, doubted myself. I've thought I was like literally like the worst guy in this entire industry. But then you got people that are like, dude, you're the man. Like you can do this, right? And so that's why it's so important that we like lift each other up, right? The second part is then just putting an exact plan together, right? So one thing that I was talking about yesterday with Billy was like, dude, we gotta download that um, that contract and we gotta we gotta memorize it, right? We have to be document experts. Who in this room wants to be a closer and wants to make at least six figures in 2024? Every single one of us should be raising our hand, right? We can all do it. You can do it today, bro. The biggest thing, guys, is there's little tweaks that we can make that are really going to help us get a lot better. I am a champion. I'm the champion. I'm successful. I'm successful. I get shit done. I get shit done. Bring it in, bring it in, bring it in. One, two, three. Nino's yeah. right. All right, y'all, we're in hood now. We're about to crush it. It's actually a solar eclipse app. Oh, crap, I just looked at it. Great way to break preoccupation on the doors, guys, letting homeowners know that there's a solar eclipse happening. We've also got some new guys that just came out, and let's get on the doors, let's get it. Yes. So biggest thing is like, you always wanna make sure that you're looking for signs of life. No, no cars in the driveway, but we're looking for is oil stains, right? So if there was an oil stain right here, then that would mean that they park here, but I don't see any oil stains, so they're either parking in the garage, or that's their car right there. So knock it once, bring it the second time, but you always wanna make sure that you're like knocking for signs of life. If they're not home, don't knock it. There's so many different word tracks, which I can give you guys all the different word tracks, right? It's not a pitch, it's a conversation. If you're just like going out and pitching people, like they'll feel that. So you wanna just like be a human. We're just two guys at the end of the day having a conversation about a really good idea. Knock the door, step way back. I do the way back, right? It's way less threatening. Hey! Congratulations, sir. So we're with the HOA and you guys won a million dollars. No, but really quick, we're just doing some training. So I appreciate you just coming out real quick. We're just helping a lot of the homeowners out well, being like just educated and updated on what's going on with the new changes going on. You know, the meter on the side of the house that just updated a couple years ago. Yeah. It used to be going pull from the grid. Now you can push back to the grid with a new net metering program. How long have you guys lived in the house? Solar. It, it used to be about yeah. solar. Now it's just about if you guys were paid properly and you guys got the do not pay bill because the old old solar program, you would have had to take money out of your pocket, like out of the checking or like win the lottery or something crazy. Whereas now if you guys do qualify, you don't come in that pocket at all. And then you're able to get all the upfront costs covered and you just go from paying the high electric bill to a much lower amount that stays yeah. fixed forever and never goes up again. We basically just take the appointments from the neighbors that call us. And then in between, we talk to a couple more people and see if we can help them out too. I'd, I'd be happy to give you a card and better, sure, better yet, card. we just build out that report for you and just drop it off for you. Okay. Really just showing you guys what's going on with the updated changes. Um, you guys have heard about the rates going up. Oh yeah. Have you guys been affected by that at all? You have three choices. Option one, you just keep dealing with the rates. You know, you're going to yeah. give the utility company over the next five, 10 years, right. you're probably paying about 150 bucks a month, I would say. Hopefully it's not 250, but that's $20,000, $30,000 that you're giving to the utility company. And that's with um, assuming a zero annual increase, right? Yeah. Do you think your rates are gonna go up again? We, we know. Probably everybody's gonna go up, yeah. Everything, yeah. right? Everything's getting more expensive. Yeah. Yep, like if we can't take the money that you're already paying for electricity to fund the whole project, we just tell you no. So it's a simple bill swap 
and then it gets locked in. So saving 30, 40 bucks a month, cool, but what about five years from now? Now you're saving three, $400 a month. The tax credit as well is the biggest, biggest, like I guess you could say like catch because not everybody does qualify for it. So our job is just to build that information for you, answer your questions, see if it's a good fit. If not, no worries, but we're just here to help. Okay. Would your wife be available later today or tomorrow for us to swing that by? Steven, I'm gonna shoot you a text with my digital business card. We're Go Green Company, so we don't okay. pass out paper products. And then if she is interested, we're gonna be here all day today. I would say it's like 85% of the way done already because we do like an aerial view of the house. So the only other information that we would just need is how much energy that this home's consuming so that we can give you guys enough power so you guys are covered over 100%. No pressure, like we don't care if you do it or not. I mean, of course we wanna help you go solar and we want to help as many people as possible, um, but it's not like a, it's not like a sales pressure or anything like that. It's just give you the information, educate you, and then it's yes or no. All right, well, Steven, before we get out of here, um, last question for you is just, if she was able to save money, would she be opposed to that? She's always for saving money, so. And, yeah. and if the house goes up in value, she probably wouldn't be opposed to that. All right. So that's as simple as that. Our job is just to get you guys the information. You go through the process and you see the numbers and you see how the panels look, you see the warranties and how everything's covered. Like you don't come out of pocket at all. Anything happens, we're, we're the local company. So we're not like an out of town, coming out here trying to like take advantage of anybody like this is really good when, when done right. You wanna learn how to read a meter? So this here was replaced 11 of 18. That was 59 months ago. So we got a total number here. It's gonna pop up after. People forget meters are to read usage. Here it is, 11014. Plug that baby in. All right, let's divide this by 59 months. We got our annual usage baby, let's get it. Hey. You saw a solar eclipse? Yeah, bro, it was pretty cool. Did you, did, you, did you see it with your hand, with your uh, with your eyes or the glasses? Oh yeah, bro, I'm tough like that. Bro. So reason we're stopping by, we're doing the solar projects. Oh okay. Have okay. you have you had anybody come by and yeah, show? Totally you? not interested in solar, bro. You said maybe you'll do it in the future. You know, the, at the end of the day, our big job is to come out here, mm -hmm. and metaphorically, these homeowners are kind of like sucking on a lollipop, saying, "I'm gonna do it someday. I'm gonna do it someday," yeah, but not yeah, right that's now. Me so right now, bro. My job is my job my job is to take that lollipop out of your mouth and throw it in the dirt and say, "Hey, look." Wait, whether you do it or not, it's up to you. Yeah. But by the end of our quick, you know, 30 second conversation, you'll at least take a second look at it because we know inflation's killer right now. If you yeah. could have locked in your gas at a dollar a gallon five years ago, it would have been a win. Oh yeah. And that's oh, what we're doing now. I love that right now. It's a diesel, bro. Yeah, man. So you're paying a hundred <laughs> bucks when it used to be like 50, yeah. right? And it's the same thing with electricity, right? Mm -hmm. So all you would do, you don't come out of pocket at all. It's not an investment. All you do is you take what you're already paying mm -hmm. and then we use that to fund this project oh, and it gets okay. it locked in and there's so many benefits for it. But the biggest thing is just, we know that the rates are gonna go up. So yeah, you're gonna save a little bit of money, 30, 40 bucks, three, four, 500 bucks this first year. But then next year you save $1,000 yeah. and then five years from now, you're saving $4,000 a year mm -hmm. and that can pay off this. I mean, obviously you own the house, you own the truck. Right now you can own your power. Yeah. So it is a selective program. Not everybody does qualify. We talked to 10 people. Seven say yes, three say no, and out of the seven, three people, four people can, can actually do it, right? People will say, I wanna do research, and it's like, hey, our job is to get you the information, see if it even makes sense, and then you do your research, right? <laughs> you guys both have your hands in your pocket. I would have your phone, and I'd be like looking up there. I feel like you're doing something, like you're like taking notes. Kind of like stand to the side, but just like, just like this in front of the door, not it. Um, one thing you can do too, when the homeowner comes to the door, is like don't like go into it right away and be like, hey, how's it going? But be like, like acting like you're like taking notes or something. You can be like, yeah, one second. Yeah, just gotta finish this real quick. All right, and then like, hey, how's it going? One thing I do like a lot of like different paraverbals is I'll like raise my eyebrows, and, like kind of like smile, but like not like a big smile. Some people, and again, there's so many different ways you can do it, but some people are like, dude, I'm kind of a jerk on the doors. Like I'm not really there to like make a friend. I'm just there to let them know about how to like go solar. But some people also are like, hey, how's it going? How's your day going? So find what works for you. All right, there's a thousand different ways to do it, but like find your style. Like take our word tracks, take what we teach you, and then put your own spin on it and like be you. That's okay. the biggest thing is like don't be fake, right? Don't be like unauthentic. Like anything that you like lose to being real, authentic, or genuine, like you didn't have in the first place. So make sure that you're always being yourself, and that's how you're gonna be successful, you know? All right, y'all already know. Message of the day stand on bidding. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. 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 It's all you. Hey, what's up, man? How are you doing today? Good, yeah. My name's Reese, by the way, man. Are you the homeowner here? Yes. Okay, cool. This is Will, by the way. Awesome. Yeah, so we're just coming by. We do the solar project in the area, man. Has somebody came by and showed you a savings report for your home? No. No, okay, cool. How much are you paying for electricity right now? Like 75 bucks a month. 75, what company are you going through? Uh, what is it, Frontier? Frontier, okay. Is that like the high end or the low end of it? What? 
I don't know. This month, I've only been here a month. Oh, you've only been here a month, so you just now moved in? Yeah. Oh, shoot. So have you ever looked into solar energy before? No, I haven't. No, you haven't? Okay, cool. So basically what we're doing today is we're just coming by and we're talking to people, informing them on what we do in the area. We're a company out of San Angelo, Texas called Nevo. So we're just stopping by, and what I do is I just set an appointment for my guy to come back. All he's going to do is come back with a savings report for your home to see if it does make sense to you. If it doesn't make sense to you, we're going to be on our way because, like I tell everybody, if it doesn't make sense to you, it doesn't make sense to me. And, I mean, there's just no point in doing doing it right mm -hmm. so is it just you in the home it's just me and my wife and my you daughter. and your wife okay cool what time are you usually home around uh, i get off at five at five okay and what about the wife she's home all day she's home all day okay yeah. cool so um what are you doing uh tomorrow yeah. so um you're gonna be home you said like 5 36 yeah. so and then you're probably gonna come home maybe you want to eat some dinner so seven o'clock is probably the best time right yeah. so um i'm gonna look at my schedule real quick and see what time i can get you in next week from the looks of it i can do either Oh, uh, well, I'm booked Wednesday pretty much. Thursday would probably be the best time at 7. That's fine. Okay, cool. I'm just going to get some information real quick, man, and then we'll swing back around. Okay, just want to verify we are going for next Thursday at 7. Just want to verify that. Last thing I do got to get, man, do you know what side of the house the meter's on? It's in the back. It's in the back? You got dogs back there? No. Okay, cool. Which way can I go to get back there? You can go that way. Okay, cool. I'm just going to go back there, grab these nine digits on the bottom. It just shows us how much energy is used and produced in the home. So that way we can create that savings port and then we'll just come back around, okay? okay. All right, appreciate it, man. Yeah, yes, sir. You. you have a blessed day. You too. I just like, I went straight forward to it. I just told them how, what I was going to do and just like come back. I mean, it's really just straightforward. I mean, if they're, if they're iffy about it, I mean, that guy was just pretty straightforward. He didn't give me no objections or anything like that. So I just went straight for the kill at that point. I mean, but with the, the bill that he's paying right now, I don't know if it's going to make sense for him, but I mean, it's always worth a try. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Yo, what's up, man? How are you doing today? What the Sam hell yeah, is so going on here? Basically, we're just a cult going around it's, trying to... Yeah, you look like a freaking cult. <laughs> my, name's Reece, my name's Reese, man. Yes, sir. So you're the homeowner here, right? I'm it, me and the dog. We just do the solar project in the area, man. Has somebody okay, came by and talked to you about on, it before? Stop. Whoa. It'll be real well, quick, man. I don't want you down panels. No Yeah, offense. of course, man. Yeah, of course. I mean, I, I, I came up here and I already knew you didn't want them. Uh -huh. but I, yeah, but I'm just here to talk to you and inform you on what we're actually doing here. Because it'd be rude if I just went over there and I talked to the guy over there and I got him set up for an appointment. I didn't come over here and talk uh, to you, man. Uh, here's the thing. What's the thing, man? Uh, one, I'm not going to save enough money. Have you ever have you ever seen a savings report? Yeah, and I know I spend on electricity. How long ago did you see a savings report? Okay, I saw one. Let's see. I think old boy at the cafe showed me one about three weeks ago. At the cafe. Yeah. Who was that? Well, it doesn't make a damn hood. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I don't. I mean, I mean don't I mean, get it, nosy, it, Jack. It wasn't me. I mean, <laughs> well, hell no, I didn't <laughs> exactly. Be yeah, I already ran so, your ass off. <laughs> now I don't want them. Yes, yeah, seriously. My insurance is going up if I have them. Work so so, for well, well, Apple, so how much do you even spend right now? I spend, well, the highest time of the year, this last summer, my electric bill was $198. That's crazy. That's still high. Well, I've, I've seen higher, but that's still pretty high. I mean, if you're spending over $100, you're probably getting screwed over. No, not really. It takes too long to pay for them, what you got. Well, I mean, the whole damn thing. Like you're saying, it takes too long to you know pay out for them. You have to repair the damage. You have to do this. Well, yeah, you roof, can pay back. You're, you can yeah. sell back to your electric company if they take it. Yeah. If they decide I mean, to change their mind, I mean, you're screwed. Yeah. Pooch. You, you seem like you know a lot about the loan, man, but you, you've you never heard of PPA before. So well, the cool thing about this, man, so all it is is a bill swap. We're swapping your bill from your electric bill right now. That is, you said like highest, like 198, something like that, right? So we're, we're putting you on a lower bill. I can't tell you how much I am going to save. It could be anywhere from like 10 to 30% on your bill right now that you're spending. Mm -hmm. And like you were saying, you, it takes too long to pay out, man. If you're, if you're not financially stable enough to even buy these panels outright, it's not really smart. It's, not a, it's a smart, not a smart investment, right? So what we're doing, man, is we do free installments on homes, which is pretty cool about it. So you don't have to take on any of the upfront cost or anything like that. And you're actually not even paying for the panels. All you're paying for is the energy that comes from the panels. Hey, what's up, man? How are you doing today? What's your name? George. Reese, nice to meet you, George. I got my gang with me right now. <laughs> so we just want to ride in your truck, man. It's not rideable. Ride Why not? It's not rideable. It don't, it don't run. Man. Oh, well, can we can we work on it real quick? No. Nah, man, I'm just messing with you. <laughs> no, nah, we're doing the, the solar projects in the area, man. Has somebody came by and oh, showed they already, you? Like, they already come by, not being denied, so. Yeah, you've been denied? Yeah, yeah. What do you mean you're denied? They, they, my credit. Oh, what's your credit saying now? Uh, I don't know, but they say it was. You don't know? Pass, you, so. you don't know your credit at all? No. So, what do you mean you don't know your credit? Is it just no, is it just no, you in the home? 
Nah, no, my wife. you and your wife, yeah. yeah. What, did they try your wife's credit? I told them no. So. No, why, why do you tell them no? That's okay. No, What's throwing I mean, you off? No, 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 yeah, of course, no, of course, no, man. No, what, what's, no, no. <laughs> yeah, so so sorry, how long ago no. was that? Uh, about last month. Okay. Last month, okay. Yeah, well, a lot of things have changed since last yeah. month, yeah. So what I'm here today to do, man, is basically just set you up a savings report and just see if it does qualify for your home. Because yeah. I can't sit here and look at your home and be like, hey, it's going to qualify. Yeah. I mean, your roof is pretty free. You don't have that much shading on it. The sun's beaming on your roof right now. Yeah. How much are you even paying for electricity right now? Right now, quite a bit. Quite a bit, yeah. yeah. So obviously, you, you most likely want to save money right yeah. do you do you stick with the same company or do you yes. shop around for that bill oh nah, uh, so, so what company are you you with just energy just energy how long you been with them uh, about 10 years 10 years and how much is that bill running you right now right now for this last two months about 300 300 yeah that's crazy man yeah, yeah so you're getting screwed over yeah. that's just the truth about it so whenever you first got in the home uh how much was it really running you then about 160 160 so from 160 to 300 that's yeah. a high jump right yeah. yeah so obviously you're probably not even using that much energy in the home they're just raising the rates on you well that according to the way the contract i signed it this it was gonna go up for you yeah of course so yeah. so obviously what they're doing is they're in control of you right yeah they're in control of how much you're going to spend if they want to raise your rates and all of that so with solar the cool thing about it is that it's inflation proof man you believe in inflation right mm -hmm. and you believe that you're going to pay that utility bill for the rest of your life right yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly because yeah. you want electricity so all this does man is locks you in at a fixed rate so you're not going to keep spending more and more and more and more over time i mean just like gas prices man inflation hit those like crazy yeah and i mean those more those are more fluctuating than electric prices because you see when electric prices rise they're going to keep on rising right yeah. so 300 right now you might next summer might be paying 400 you, you don't know right yeah. and you don't have that security so with solar it gives you that sense of security you like security right good, of, good. of course right yeah. so i can't tell you that you qualify or anything like this i'm not going to sit here and promise you this or this yeah, with that yeah, right yeah. yeah so all i do like i said before we just create that savings report man it takes like 30 minutes it's, all it is is basically like a free home assessment we just right. come by stop by with you of course you probably sat you, you said you sat down with somebody yes. else right so i would just have my guy probably one of these guys over here come by and sit down with you and actually show you it yeah. so whenever we do come back it's not that hey do this do this do this it's more of a hey this is what we can offer you and this is how it would work with you yeah and we're gonna work with you to work with us to see if it makes sense man yeah. so we're gonna we're gonna stop by at five like five ish okay we're gonna come back it's not gonna be all of us you're not gonna have like 10 people coming right. to your house like yeah. hey do this do this. you know what i mean <laughs> yeah but it's just gonna be one of us we're just gonna come by around five real quick just stop by show you that savings report and then if it doesn't make sense we're gonna be gone okay yeah. okay which side of the house is that meter on it's in the back in the, in the back in do the you got you got dogs back there yeah mean ones Nah, not. Okay, I love dogs yeah. then. Okay, I'm gonna go back there. I'm gonna go take a picture of that meter real quick and then I'm gonna come right back, okay? We gotta go this way. Right, go this way? Can you show uh, me yeah, one? Yeah, there's no door that way. Okay, cool, man. Come on in. All right, so we're in the middle of our knocking session. Reese, you've set seven appointments so far today, bro, which is really incredible. Do you have any advice for everybody for how they can do that too and kind of like what your journey has been to get you to this point? Yeah, so basically a little bit about myself. My name's Reese. I'm from San Angelo originally. I got into this by Josh over there. He worked at Chipotle and then I called him up one time and I was just like, hey, I want to do solar energy. So I just got into it. I've always been like dreaming about doing sales and stuff like that. So I've always talked to people. I have the confidence and stuff like that. And that's really the main thing about why I like have success in what I do is just really the confidence, man. Because, you know, just like you said, seven already and it's like 3.30 right now and it's, it's real early and everything like that. I can go off and I can get way more, right? But it's just about how I talk to people. I'm, I'm sitting there and I'm concerned more about their concerns than my concerns about making money. I'm sitting there and I'm like, what What about solar is, you know, what's throwing you off about it? Why don't you have it? What's this, 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 and that? I'm drawing them out so that way I'm really no men and then I'm going in with the hook and I'm going in for the kill. There's no way that they tell me no. There's no reason they're going to tell me no because if I go in there and I give it my all and everything like that, they're not gonna tell me no. And it's just like, like if I look at that roof over there and I'm like, I already see that they're gonna get solar. Whenever I go up there, my mindset is, you're going to get it instead of I don't know if they're going to get solar they might not get solar this this and that I'm not going to be confident so it's just all about my confidence really hello there nice to meet you ma'am my name's Andrew I'm with Nevo okay nice to meet you ma'am um just here talking to all the homeowners because every house is different so we're just because people are paying a high cost with their electric bill um do you know how much you guys pay exactly a month Okay, so like 100 on average, basically. Um, Just a minute, let me. No problem. So you want to check this out, okay? Mm -hmm. This is definitely going to help you out a lot. 
because do you see right there that that little number right there mm -hmm. is your eyesight good cool so it says you're paying eight cents right but then do you see how they have that AEP Texas North delivery yeah. charge as well as all the other extra charges on there, the base energy charge? This is where they get you, all right? So what we do is we take 102, which is what your monthly bill was, and then you divide it by how much kilowattage that you used, and that's where you're actually paying double. They've made this make sense in every single way as long as you're able to qualify for it. Our engineer is working with your neighbor right now. He'd be available to pop by and show this to you in about 20 minutes, and then he can just leave this with you and you can think about it Pray about it, show it to your family. We've got everything we need right here. Do you have um, 15 minutes in about 20 minutes for us to drop by and drop this report off for you? Yeah. Cool, that's back for you. And then we would just need a few uh, pieces of information from you so we can generate that report real quick. And then hopefully it works out. If not, we'll just get you your, uh, what do you call it? Like your PhD and how it works, all right? Uh, Kyler will be here in about 10 minutes, 15 okay. minutes. Um, that's fine. If you got a small corner of a table, couch whatever works and just yeah. glass of water and he'll take 15 20 minutes all right okay hello nice to meet you my name's leslie this is will this is matt and then this is andrew we're just looking for the homeowners is that you sir she's inside oh she didn't answer um do you mind getting her for us just gotta mark her off as yes or no hi how are you doing are you are you the homeowner here yeah awesome my name is william we're just working with a few of your neighbors and really just updating people on the new changes going on in regards to the meter on the side of your house mm -hmm. you guys have lived here for the last couple of years yeah. Do you remember when they updated it? You guys have seen it all over the news. They're saying conserve energy, don't use electricity during the summer just because like the grid popped a couple years ago and their goal is to have one third of homeowners mm -hmm. get off the grid by 2025. So research has shown that's what our company is doing, that a lot of your neighbors um, would be able to qualify for this, where all you would do is you would redirect that to a much lower amount that just never goes up again. No more inflation. So what we do is we, we uh, help you out with qualifying to basically instead of you guys consuming power here mm -hmm. you guys would produce it on site and instead of you having to pay electric bill you would get that replaced with a much smaller amount and then no more inflation so you're inflation proof building equity into the house so what we would do is just take a picture of the meter like we're doing for a lot of your neighbors and then just seeing if it even makes sense and then just showing you guys where they would go and then if it's a good fit then we'd help you out with submitting the application and get approved and then if not you just know how it works but the reason why people are doing this is because they don't have to pay anything out of pocket and they go from paying 130 down to maybe like 80. So you're gonna save money today, but the biggest thing is saving money for the future. So they're really pushing this and they're making it make sense in every way. As long as the roof's good, meter's up to date and everything else checks off, then you would basically win the, the lottery because this is something that's gonna put a lot of money in your pocket over the next like 10, 20 years. We're already here. He's working with your neighbor right now and he could swing by, take 15, 20 minutes, three things he would do for you. The first one is he would answer all any questions you have. Again, the biggest questions people have is like, what happens to the roof? and um, who maintains it and how much money do we save and then number two is like we're just here to help so if there is any reason that you find that you don't like it there's like a red flag then we're just going to tell you no right and then just show you how to qualify for the program there's no decision to make today just here to get you all your information help you do your research okay. and then if it makes sense cool if not now you know how it works do you think tomorrow would be monday be better tuesday cool you think like in the afternoon two or four maybe yeah. okay you want to do two or four two okay perfect and then all i would need from you is just that usage so that we can put that together it's that bar graph right there do you have a paper copy or do you get it on your phone do you mind just grabbing it real quick i'm gonna grab a picture of the meter and then we'll just put that in there and then we'll plan on uh tuesday at uh, four o'clock and then is your meter in the back of the house yeah cool if um i don't know if you got any dogs back there whoa that's a lot so yeah so how, how you would do it i can tell you got a couple people living in here that's a lot of energy all right so how you would do it to see what you're actually paying per kilowatt because you're the exact same as your neighbor, eight cents. But then you see all the charges. So you take that 349 divided by 2411. Yeah, and that's where you're paying 14 cents. So if you used on average 2400, what's 2400 times 12? And obviously that's a higher month. So let's just say 2200 times 12. So you're using 26,000 kilowatts a year. So that's how much you're giving to the utility company each year, mm -hmm. which is a lot, almost $4,000 makes sense in every single way. It's just a matter of you guys getting qualified for it. So I'll send this over to Kyler. Um, Leslie is okay if you grab Leslie's contact and uh, put that in the calendar. Sometimes you just gotta hold people's hand. It's also funny, she said it was $130. That's a $345 bill. Definitely gonna be able to help her out. If everything comes back good, this is gonna be a good deal, guys. Let's go. Hello. Hi, Hi nice to meet you. 
My name is Leslie. I'm just looking for you guys because a lot of your neighbors have been complaining about the high power bills. Have you guys seen the same thing? What was the highest you guys are paying for power? <laughs> okay, yeah, because you guys are definitely paying more than your neighbors are. Okay. What's oh, yeah, well, I have a house called up six, so there's always, oh. about, there's always somebody home. Oh, that makes so. sense. The kids forget to turn off the lights. Oh, yeah. So the reason they send us out is because what's going on with the grid. Mm -hmm. The grid is very old and it's taking a lot of toll because like all these houses that it needs to power. Mm -hmm. So what's happening is it keeps breaking down and all of those fees are putting it on the customer. Mm -hmm. So you're going to notice a lot of rate increases coming in these up couple of months. So what we're doing is we're seeing if the house qualifies, we go ahead and we eliminate your power bill altogether and we replace it for a cheaper bill that stays the same every single month. So you're able to budget and save some money. But have you guys looked into solar already? No, my husband is not wanting solar. <laughs> oh, how does he feel about That's it? That's why he put this little... <laughs> no solicitor? <laughs> yes. Do you know why they keep sending us out? What's happening is more houses that go green, mm -hmm. you guys are helping with the grid, and now the power company is going to pay you guys with credits mm -hmm. since you're helping out. So how solar works is it's just to give you guys some control as well, right? Not every house qualifies for solar mm -hmm. because one, we have to make sure it's cheaper than what you're paying the utility company. Mm -hmm. And obviously you need to be able to save money. Are you guys interested in saving money? Oh, who is it, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, but you said weekends are usually his time off. Mm -hmm. Do you think you guys would spare 15 minutes tomorrow? I doubt it. I'm telling you, he's not going to go for it. <laughs> okay. No worries. Well, it was really nice to meet you. You too. Thank you. I hope you have you. a good day. Hopefully you can get somebody here, though. <laughs> B biggest thing I would leave you with is just like, you're going to give that money up either way. So you could give that to the utility company, mm -hmm. right, with, with the inflation. Mm -hmm. So it's like if your average bill is like 250 bucks right now, that's... What is that? 250 times 12 is like $2,700 a year. Mm -hmm. So if you guys live here for another two years, you could either put that $5,000 into the utility company that you don't get any return on that, mm -hmm. or you could put that back into the value of your house, right? Right. So then it's actually a huge selling feature and kind of like she was talking about. So my background's in real estate, both commercial and residential. Mm -hmm. So the biggest thing is that it helps the house go up in value by about 4.2% on average. So the house is worth more now. And it's actually like, cause we know the rates are going up mm -hmm. for sure. Your truck out here, if you were paying a dollar a gallon, like you'd rather do that, right? And instead of paying five, six bucks, right? Right. Three years from now, this house will sell for more because instead of you paying three or $400 a month, mm -hmm. you have your rates locked in at like $100. But all we do is we would just show you guys how you'd be able to bill swap it. Mm -hmm. And then for the next homeowner, they're gonna be in a better situation too. Like obviously it's more about you guys. Right. But in the next like two, three years, however long you guys plan on being here for, mm -hmm. which we always know people are gonna move within five to seven years. Mm -hmm. So either way, it's like gonna be a really good situation for, for now, right? But mm -hmm. then especially for like the next homeowner and like for the future, right? For you guys to be able to take that $5,000 mm -hmm. and just have that be in your pocket instead of the utility company's pocket. Right. That's right. the biggest thing there. Like people just don't know what they don't know. So our job is just to educate you guys and show you guys how this would help you guys save at least a couple thousand dollars mm -hmm. instead of burning it to the utility company because you're obviously owning this house, right? Right. If you rent it, you're just paying off some millionaire's house. I know if you guys took 10 minutes, uh -huh. you would at least consider it maybe a little bit more because like mm -hmm. our thing is like homeowners, right? We're both chewing gum right now, but homeowners are like sucking on a lollipop being like, I'll do it someday. I'll do it on the next house. But our job is to like take your lollipop, throw it in the dirt and be like, hey, like you guys are literally going to throw so much money away to the utility company. Right. And it's something that you could really put your family in a much better situation. This is called a PPA. Okay. It's essentially like we're just renting out the roof space. Right. And instead of you guys putting your money into the utility company, you put it into the solar. Okay. Same thing when you guys sell the house, next homeowner, right? They take on the Wi-Fi, they take on the electric, they take on the, um, you know what I mean? Yeah, like the, the utilities, yeah, right. same thing with the solar. Okay. Um, if you Google it, how much more does a house sell with solar? It's 4.2% more. Okay. And it's obviously different with every single situation, right. but imagine your house selling for an extra $12,000, right? right? Yeah. Either way, you're gonna pay the money. It's just, do you wanna put it into the utility company's pocket or do you guys wanna go on vacation? Do you wanna right. put your money into a, a liability? Or do you want to put it into your, you know, yeah. an, an, an asset, right? It's, yeah. it's, it's ownership. Right. So the only reason why we're being so persistent, pl pleasantly persistent, I guess, it's like, because like we know this is the right thing. We've helped hundreds of homeowners out. More solar is going to be installed the next two years than the last 40 years combined. Either way, again, you're going to pay it. You've seen it all over the news, the Inflation Reduction Act, the new green deal. Right. And it's essentially either you pay that with them taxing coal, oil, and fossil fuels, or you take it and you put that into the value of your house. Would you be opposed to us taking 15, 20 minutes tomorrow, late afternoon? Four o'clock. No problem with that. That's fine. Cool. Yeah. The, the guy that comes by with her, he's awesome. He's been doing this since 2015. His name's Kyler. Okay. Um, and he's just professional, right? Right. Like okay. really, really good at what he does. But three things that he's going to do, and this is not a like 
no sales pressure, right? Like we come out here, like our job is to like set up the time for an injury to come by. Right. But then like once you guys have the information, the ball's in your court, right? We can't sign up for you. Like you guys right. have to actually submit the application, right. but you guys go through the process. You guys see that it makes sense. You guys see that bottom dollar that you guys will save the first month, six months from now, 12 months from now, 24 months uh, from now, just based on the projections. Like that's what you're gonna give to the utility company over the next like five years based on you guys paying $150. Okay. So, but that's that's it. Like you guys go through the process, you see how it works, see why uh, we're able to help so many people out, see the warranties, and then just see how much you guys would save and then answer any questions you guys have. The questions okay. that they're gonna um, t uh, uh, answer for you is the ones that you guys are probably gonna wanna know the most about, about like what happens when we move. How does that work? But it's like this, right? Like, just cause I care, it's like, if a bus came by and your kid was in the street, I'm pulling your kid out of the street, right? So same thing with the utility company, people are getting bulldozed from it. Um, the way that I got in a solar was my grandma. She couldn't even like pay, uh, she couldn't even like do, um, um, like cook during prime time. She's right. from California just because like it was so expensive, right? Yeah, so what happens is for me, I like to keep my AC at like 64, right? But like we weren't able to do that anymore. So I'd have to crank it at 72 and then I'm miserable and I'm sweating all summer, right? So this is something that like you can keep your AC low, you can keep the same amount of energy, but like just no more inflation. Yeah. And um, yeah, you guys be really happy with this if everything comes back good. Um, the last thing is just how to qualify for it. So right. leave that with you. Yes, think about it, pray about it. Show it to your accountant, show it to your family, whatever you guys want to do, but we'll, we'll get that for you guys. All we would need is just take a picture of the meter and then the um, the um, utility bill. Do you guys get that in the mail or do you get it online? Online. Because what, what we're doing here is if you look at them, they're paying eight cents a kilowatt, 647 kilowatts, 102 a month. So how we calculate what they're actually paying is you get 102 divided by 647. So they're really paying like double. That's it right there. Want to grab a picture of that, Leslie? And then we're just going to take a picture of the meter to make sure that it's up to date. It's on this side or this side? It's going to be on this side. On this side? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's going to meet you, brother. Right. Thank you. 200 amps. It's perfect. It was good, but we needed the DM. Once the DM was there, definitely more solid. All right, guys, like Leslie just said, we got to make sure that we were getting the decision maker on the door in order to actually help them out, right? Because the biggest thing is the, home, the husband was inside. And I, I always tell guys, it's like, think and like put yourself in the homeowner's shoes, right? They're inside right now and they're probably listening, right? And so I think he saw that we were pleasantly persistent and he finally came out. It was awesome. And we just made it make sense and they knew how much we cared, right? How's it going, fellas? Not much. How about you? Just want to let you guys know that you guys are not going to be able to qualify for the new solar program. Yeah, I'd love to, I'd love to help you guys out. It's just no way it's going to be able to work just with the trees. So just want to let you, just want to let you guys know. Okay. Yeah. Really wish it it would work because it's saving people a ton of money just with inflation. I was at like an all time high and stuff, and yeah. we're able to help you guys own your power and put money into an investment instead of a uh, liability with uh, with renting your power. But there's just not it's not going to be able to work with your house. Okay. So I just want to let you know. All right. Yep. I wish it could happen, but literally it's like slim to nothing and some just walked out the door like zero chance all right we had another amazing day out here in texas with the greatest sales force on planet earth this is the ninos we're a family we're going to war against the utility company as always guys click this link in the bio to join the number one solar sales team in america and we'll see you guys in the next episode